Following Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi's Kiev visit, Ukrainian President Zelensky proposed a second Ukrainian peace summit, which is to be held in one of the global south countries, preferably in India. Supporting New Delhi as the new potential host for peace negotiations in the ongoing war with Russia, Zelensky said he isn't pressuring any country, but it is only logical to have the South Asian nation brokering the next talks as it is, quote-unquote, a great country, a great democracy. Listen in to the Ukrainian president's answer when Vion Sidhan Sibyl questioned him on Indian-backed peace summit. India також bere участь в нашій роботі щодо формули миру. Була представлена India is also participating in our work on the peace formula. It was represented at the peace summit and we are working in the relevant groups according to the peace formula. All of this gives us optimism and it is important that as many global actors as possible clearly express their position on the fundamental norms of international law and visit Ukraine, showing their support in a tangible way. Of course, today we also discussed the bilateral agenda with India. Four intergovernmental documents were signed by our representatives. There are also agreements on the other areas of cooperation, including military technical cooperation. The Ukrainian president added that he's also in discussions with other countries like Saudi Arabia, Qatar, Turkey and Switzerland regarding the summit, but insisted that the peace summit can only be hosted in a country that is a signatory of the summit's joint declaration for peace. Zelensky was addressing a conference of Indian journalists. He said that during his meeting with PM Modi, all aspects of the first peace summit's communique, including the key points of the declaration, were discussed. He expressed openness to India's participation in various points of the peace formula, but particularly pushed for India's involvement in the humanitarian aspect of returning the displaced Ukrainian children affected by the war. Now, Zelensky said, and I'm going to quote here, we would be pleased if India joined this point of the formula, the return of children to the humanitarian aspect, from the point of view of your neutral status. During his visit to Kiev, Prime Minister Modi urged Ukraine to opt for a path of dialogue with Russia for the resolution of the conflict, he offered to act as, quote-unquote, a friend to help bring peace. Ukraine held the first peace conference in June this year, which was attended by the officials from more than 90 countries. Moscow, however, was not invited. Last month, Russia's deputy foreign minister said Moscow will not attend the second summit because its proposals will be ignored. Kiev and its allies have made clear that Ukraine's territorial integrity must be the cornerstone of any peace deal with Russia, having previously rejected the prospect of ceding territory in exchange for a ceasefire.